Good morning. Have you seen my latest video? I'm just watching it right here on my phone. So if you have not seen it, you guys should go and check it out. So it's actually day. Um, I've lost track of time, but I'm at Dreams Onyx. I left Dreams Punta Cana yesterday, and I am going to have some breakfast. I really, really took my time. I rested well, man. I needed my rest you know on vacation i try as much as possible to rest even as much as i'm vlogging and showing you guys the results and the tours but i still want to rest i still haven't really figured out my way around it's a bit more complicated to find my way around so i have to go and book my covid test so we have to do the antigen test which the resort covers it's free and then i will go and eat and after that hook up with my friends our friends came here from out of town from canada and all of that because we're actually at onyx for a 50th birthday party of one of our friends kingsley i made i showed him in my yesterday's video so you guys should stay tuned but first let me go and figure out my covid test because i really have to get that done if i don't do my covid test if i don't pass my covid test 14 days in the result and i don't want that to happen so i have my mask here guys i've turned i'm not as light as i was when i came because it's the sun now spending so much time in the sun will do that to you we were trying to get the booster before leaving on vacation but we couldn't get in we wanted to go to like walgreens or something to get our booster shot but we couldn't get an appointment before we left for our travel so as soon as we get back we're going to get our booster shot so i'm going to encourage everybody to get your booster shot they keep telling us <laughs> get your shots get your shots life will return back to normal i just praying cha. i don't think it's just the shot i think it's more of prayer committing your uh, yourself into god's hands and then staying safe too because we took the first booster uh, the first shot one and two still got the covid but it was mild Hi guys! It's raining here in Punta Cana. It rains a lot. I guess it's the rainy season. It's December. See, it's raining again. It rained yesterday. It rained the day before yesterday. So, almost all the days we've been here, it's been raining. It rains a little bit and then it stops and then the sun comes out. So, it's not too bad. You still have time to catch a break and do stuff when it's not raining so i miss breakfast it's now 12.03 i slept late yesterday so i didn't get up early i took my time i did my edits i uploaded my video the buffet is going to open at 12.30 it's now 12.04 so i have a couple of minutes to just chill so i just wanted to talk about this the difference between the dreams punta cana and the dreams onyx in life when you see something and you think it's the best thing ever like when we were at dreams in Takana, we were content contentment is good right and contentment is very very good but you cannot stay where you are if you want to make progress in life so dreams onyx was built in 2016 if we had gone to dreams with Takana and gone back home we would have been happy no complaints but by the time we by the time we came to Dreams Onyx and it was much much better advanced, Dreams Punta Cana looked kind of age dated to us. So that's how life is. You have to keep upgrading yourself in your career, in whatever you do, because if you don't, everybody's going to leave you behind. Like Dreams Punta Cana, it was not that full. Cool. I thought it was because of COVID and a lot of people there were older people. The food wasn't that great. When we came to Dreams Onyx, we saw a lot more people. People like things that are fresh. 
So you just have to refresh yourself every now and then, refresh your career, learn new things. That's, I like to see lessons in everything I do. Because if you don't upgrade yourself, you're just going to be left behind. That's why there were so few people in Dreams Muntakana, which was built way, way back. My understanding is that it was one of the first resorts that they had in Punta Cana and now they have a lot more. I think they have like five. They opened another one which is now recent than the now. If you've been with a company for 10 years, 20 years and you don't look out, you won't know your worth, you won't know your value. I'm not saying you should rush and go and get another job but just know your worth. You might even be able to get market yourself, negotiate a better deal at your same work if you know your worth. Like for instance, someone was calling me for a career opportunity and he was telling me a price and I had done my research. I had found out that that career level gets paid way, way more than that position was trying to offer me. So know your worth, find out what your market value is, stay up to date and so that you don't get left behind. Check out my nails, guys. I did them myself. Hi guys! I have Bay here with me. We're doing lunch together. Say hi! Say hi! Say hi everyone! So what do you recommend for lunch? What do you recommend? Lomo Santiago. Santiago? What's that? Blomo? Is that? Blomo. Beef? Beef. Beef. Yeah. No, I Beef don't like it. It's tender. It's very, very tender. He would like that one. Very what tender. about me? Seafood. I like seafood. Seafood salmon. Salmon. What salmon. kind of salmon? The pig. The vegetables. vegetables. Yeah. Vegetables. Yeah. Vegetables. 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 <laughs> I'm not that picky, but sometimes I don't I, like I, I sweets. Pasta, I don't like meat. Pasta with shrimp. I don't like pasta. Pasta with shrimp. Pasta with shrimp. Okay, you know what? I don't, Can you put pasta with shrimp and the beef? Okay. You cut pasta bread. with shrimp and the beef. No, okay. no, it's for me. I like, okay. I like. She do you have? Like. What do you have? Oh, we can check the menu, right? Mm. Just check the menu. Don't worry. Okay. Tell okay. You, you tell us the gist. Huh? Yeah. No, I don't. I want the uh, meat. I don't like meat. Bay likes meat. He's a meatarian. Me, I'm a veggie fish. Oh, okay. I've been tanning, guys. Oh, that's nice. Ah, your phone is taking good pictures, though. Okay. Your phone takes good pictures. So, mimosa. Peanut butter. Yeah. Wow, that is lovely. I'm saving my tummy for lunch. <laughs> I hope it turns out right too. Even the ambience. Ambience is very, very good. You with the, let me show you guys the ambience. Nowadays, you don't need paper menu because of COVID. You have to stay safe. So now you have to scan the menu. Mm -hmm. Specialties. Pina colada, that's mine. Thank you. Did you bring a straw? Yes. That's my pina colada, guys. Yum. Mm. I don't know if this is aloe vera or whatever it is. So, specialty seafood and rice pottage. I tried that rice pottage yesterday. I didn't like it, it was like watery rice. <laughs> so I'm not doing that again today. Main course, spaghetti, agileo, I'm not a pasta person. Teriyaki salmon. I'm gonna try the teriyaki salmon. Salmon teriyaki. So guys, I'm having the teriyaki salmon. With vegetables, broccoli. Let me taste it. It looks very nice. See what it tastes like. Oh, salt. Ah, I don't eat a lot of salt, so it tastes salty to me. Some people might not mind the salt, but me, I don't like salt. Dessert. It's supposed to be brownie. Let me taste it. Guys, look at all the calories I'm putting. 
give you a good review of all the food. Mmm, <laughs> it's warm and nice. It's very nice. I got water. I didn't have breakfast, so I did some okay. There's Breathless Resort, Resort Adult Only, where we'll be having dinner tonight. So I'm looking forward to that. I want to go take a walk on the beach because, of course, I'm a beach lover. And I'll try to save my, my heart from flying away because it's very, very windy. It's beautiful. Ah, it's so windy. Very, very windy. Ooh, I have to hold it so I don't lose it. <laughs> They just brought me some pina colada right here while uh, chilling on the beach. Try to not to lose my heart. Love yourself enough to enjoy your own company, which is what I love to do at times. I love to enjoy my own company sometimes. Play hard. Play hard. Work hard, pray hard, play hard. In fact, it should be pray hard, work hard, play hard, enjoy your life. Life is short. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. It's better now. Hi, guys. Sorry for you guys. Oh, say hi, guys. Hi, guys. Hi, guys. Look at Madam Celebrant. Do you want me to? Do you want me okay, to? Me put my touch. The wife of the Celebrant. Look at hey. her. Hey. Okay. It's me. Oh. I look at Ogavalo himself. How about now? Jingle bell, jingle bell, jingle bell, jingle bell, jingle bell. Oh, you guys. We are leaving. Turn it to us. Ahead. Jingle bell, 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 j
Thank you, my love. Let us scan and see what's up to. It says dress code casual elegance. Pass. <laughs> Lamb chops. Ratatouille. Yeah, okay. One, guys, have you tried ratatouille? Yeah. Is it good? This bread for Remember the movie now? Ratatouille. Ratatouille. Very rare. Yeah. I think I'm going to do the ratatouille. Lamb chops. Lamb chops. And we have lamb chops. Lamb chops as well. Lamb chops. Wow. Nice. Bon appetit. Wow, it looks nice. I hope it tastes nice. Presentation number. Mm -hmm. Presentation. Give them a. This is eggplant. Let me grab the video. Yeah. Look at on them. They did a good job. Oh, no. It's lean. 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 It's The food was yummy, delicious. I am. Um... Agaba, say hi to my auntie. <laughs> That's Agaba. I know big thing. Agaba, it's camera shy. Are you camera shy? Oh, not at all. Not at all. Welcome to my YouTube channel. <laughs> it's good to be here. Finally. What are you guys having? Yeah. Okay. So, that miles like 30,000 steps. Hey. Good to see you. Oh, good you. Uh -uh. Okay, so now, how are you? Welcome. Are you Good to see you guys. No, beat you. It's no YouTube, it's beat you. <laughs> Say hi. This is Bumi, all the way from from Toronto. Hi. Say hi. All the way from Toronto, Pastor. Okay. Say hi. <laughs> so we just had dinner. Very nice. Tequila for you. No, thank you. No tequila for me. Pina colada. No alcohol. Okay. Yeah, so we are still here. Hi guys, this is my beautiful friend Delaco. We are both in the ATL, but right now we are in, yeah, we're in, in Punta Cana. We are in Breathless. Breathless Punta Cana. Beautiful, beautiful resort. Delaco is a travel consultant. So if you need that travel consultant, let me know. I'll hook you up with Delaco. Delaco, tell us your the best thing about what you do, what you love most about what you do. Well, the thing that I love the most, first and foremost, actually, let me say thank you for um, giving me the platform to talk about travel. Uh, about travel and She's travel been hooking us up all our travel agents. <laughs> <laughs> well, you guys pay for it. It's <laughs> <I'm> broke. <laughs> What I do is I enjoy travel, it gives me an opportunity to work and at the same time do what I love to do the most, which is traveling. So I get to travel and I get to work on mm -hmm. So it's not really like a job. You know when you do what you they say when you do what you love, you don't have to work a day in your life. Exactly. So it's fun work. Exactly. I want to be like you when I come. 
So yeah, what is your feel? Okay, when we you were not done with telling me your yeah, feeling. Yeah, I wanted to say that travel gives me a lot of flexibility. Mm -hmm. um, it enables me to travel to all the different places. Because mm -hmm. as I travel around, okay. I can check all these places that I've always wanted to go to. Yeah. So I'm super so happy. I really love that a lot about travel. And um, I get to spend time with family. I get to spend time with friends. Mm -hmm. so, mm -hmm. And I'm not mm -hmm. That's what the least I get to make money as well. Yeah. So, what's better than that? You, know, you travel, you enjoy different parts of the world, exactly. and then you make money as well. So those are the reasons why I enjoy what I do. Yeah. So where is the best place you would recommend for travel? Vacation. Well, it depends on the individual, it depends on what you want to do, what you want to do, what you want to do. Mm -hmm. But for places that you want to get to, to mm -hmm. places can cool. It's can cool, yeah. Get to a place the beaches. Oh, yeah. So Cancun is one of my favorite places. But in terms of what people like, it depends on the individual. Yeah. 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 So it just really depends on the individual. So you can book someone up with you. Oh, definitely. Yeah. Anywhere in the world. Wow. Anywhere Amazing. So anywhere. Anywhere you want to yeah. I'll leave her uh, your contact, your email, your website. I'll leave her in the description below. So guys, patronize delicious mama. If you want to have that world class travel experience. Yeah, I totally agree. Reach out to me, I'll give you the best service as I always say. You can book anything online, but you cannot. But you can book a good, good experience you can book online. A good experience online. You know, if you want um, anyhow anything, you know where to go, Expedia and all that. But if you want a good experience, a memorable experience, reach out to me. And I'll take. I'll take care of you. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you. No problem, Dolly. She's, she's checking out. Where are we going next? Um, let's not well, tell them. Surprise. Surprise. Sub subscribe so that you can find out where we're going next, yes, okay? Yes, we have a lot in store for you. Yeah, definitely, definitely. And this place is a fantastic, fantastic beautiful island. Beautiful Punta Cana, Breathless Resort, Onyx Resort, yes. Dominican Republic. Beautiful, beautiful. Thank you, Tolapo. Thank you for coming on my channel to talk about what you do. We're still going to have a detailed experience. The what the do's and don'ts don't of travel. Right, Tolapo? You can teach us the do's and don'ts of travel. So watch out for that video. <laughs> Thank you, Delicious. You're welcome. This place is called Spoon. It's a buffet style restaurant at Breathless Utakana. Did you get everybody? Did you get me? <laughs> and that's the chief celebrant. <laughs> Tell me. And that's the chief celebrant's first lady. Wow. First lady, how now? <laughs>
I'm just going to close out this video now because we have other activities planned tomorrow. So if you're yet to subscribe, please don't forget to subscribe, like, share, comment below. Click that notification bell so you don't miss any of my videos. Alright, thank you so so much and see you in my next video. Bye.